Hello everyone, my name is Jumat and today we're going to do a Tulia Meat Guide in Diamond 1 because I dropped from Masters because I didn't play enough. And we're going to play against a pretty annoying comp with Nautilus, Yasuo, Sheiko, Chogat. All of all four of these champions can scale and help their team very well with a, with either tons of CC or instant bursts. CC from Nautilus, burst from the Shaco and Chogat ult and obviously the Yasuo which is annoying as hell. And we're going to play Tilia mid against Yasuo which is probably one of the most difficult matchups. We're playing with armor here. Also we're playing with Electrocute, Cheap Shot, Eyeball Collection, Ravenous Hunter, Presence of Mind, Captive Grace. And these runes that's right here we're going for GLP straight. After that we're going for uh, perhaps Anti-Heals or Orb into Rabadons or a armor item because that would be immensely useful. I'm gonna throw an auto attack there, I'm gonna throw a full Q, I'm gonna get this as well. Now we gotta be careful because Shaco has Ignite, but that could be also an advantage for us because uh, because of the fact that if we catch him and he has his Q on cooldown then we are good to go. I also have a Rek'Sai which is a very strong champion to set me up. And I dodged that. Also, I am afraid that I'll get frame drops, but we're going to see soon what's going to happen. He's gonna go closer here. I'm gonna cast a Q right now. Okay, and I'm gonna probably lose. Oh. <laughs> okay, didn't lose. <laughs> Thought I was gonna lose. I was going to lose these minions, but now we can just go here somewhere. We can do a deep word. Okay. Yeah, so worth it there as well. And Shaco might be top as well. Yeah, so worth it there, so you gotta be aware of it. Man, okay, good, 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 good. He cleared it. And we're backing off because we want this cannon minion. Okay. And we're gonna get this as well. And this one, so. We're trying not to lose too much CS here, and we gotta be careful also to the Shaco that might be around, and we don't need to. Oops, I missed that. We don't need to go too deep. I'm gonna throw a Q there. Also, I am only one CS behind, and perhaps we're going to start doing fine here. Okay, we have a gank. We have a kill on Caitlyn. And also, if you're careful, should have flashed instantly for it, but I didn't really want to waste my flash for a kill on Yasuo, because then he could just come back, and we would have, I would have probably just died in the next trade. So I would like to use my flash reactively, not proactively, as in a gank from Nautilus or such. And I'm gonna go right here. Okay, there is that. Okay, I got him, and I'm just running off away here, and he's backing off because, okay, maybe, can I get that? Okay, that, that was great. That was a great setup onto the Shaco. We got a first kill here on him and I also have blue. Also, I lost a little bit of CS, but that's understandable, I guess. And I'm going to make level 5 now as well. And I still have my flash, which is what I like about it. Just gonna throw a Q here. Now, once Yasuo is level 6, this game complicates infinitely more, especially if I don't have flash. So that's why I wanted to keep the flash, to be careful with it and to have it. I could have probably flashed for a combo onto him, but was, would that that would that be actually great? I don't think so. So we see now a fight here. We see a Caitlyn killing a that. Also, I should ping that Yasuo is missing. Oh, never mind. He's recalling as well. And okay, we have a teleport from the Chogat. 
pretty much useless teleport. And I don't think I should have done anything. This level 5. It doesn't matter if he teleports or not there. Also, again, frame drops. It seems that my laptop cannot longer handle this game properly. Okay, I'm gonna do an electrocut proc there. Half of each HP, sorry. Stuttering. Dodging that. Okay, he has ult. I have ult. And I could go bot here. This this is a pushed lane. Okay, never mind. Uh, Rexai is coming, so I'm not going bot yet. But this is uh, an opportunity to get the kill on Yasuo here. I'm just gonna throw a full combo because probably they are at Drake. this buddy. The Nautilus was there. Zero two. This is already hard to hard to play with. Because Shaco is fed and that's exactly what we didn't want to happen. But because he went bots. He's 3-1 now. Shogat also helped them. Hopefully the support and the ADC will start to be a bit better because we can't we can't really keep up. Okay, I'm gonna throw here a full combo because they are probably onto the Drake. I'm gonna do this. All right. Till I have GLP, I don't wanna risk much, so that's why I'm playing so defensively. Currently, I played well didn't die even though I'm behind the CS I am okay in rest and also Kenan got the kill on top that's an amazing thing and we get the kill here on Shaco on uh, sorry on Nautilus maybe also onto the guy maybe if I flash but nah maybe the Drake will help us more Drake, free Drake here, and plates for Yasuo, that's bad for me, but we could probably get this. That's all we gotta do at least, if we can't kill them on bot, we can maybe perhaps get this. Okay, so that's fine, that's a small win, even though I'm 20, 30 CS behind, these small wins are actually pushing us forward. Because we failed in getting a kill on bot, but we won in getting that break. Right? Okay, got that as well. Soon enough I'll have that item and hopefully I will manage to <laughs> stop these raindrops. I'm gonna cast W onto that. And okay. Got a recall now. Gotta go for this. Still not having enough gold for it, but I can't stay on lane anymore because I have no mana. So I'm just going for Hex to Revolver here in Boots. Also, I'm going to Alt Tab so Let me check it real quick. But we can't do any more. Mm, yeah, nah. Someone died. But I couldn't. It was Alt Tab. Yep, Janna died. 0 2. We're gonna get dived back off, back off, back off, back off. I mean, if she didn't back off there. Oh my god, I lost all of this wave because I was looking for Back off. If we get Herald, it's fine. If Caitlyn dies, she's pretty much stupid. Yep. She had all the time in the world to back off there. But in hindsight, it's fine because she can got the shutdown onto that guy. There might be an Nautilus following. So, also, again, farming gas, so farming and farming. Pro 
probably show that he'll die here. Okay, get that one too. Uh, never mind. I can recall now, I can go for the GLP and the potion. It's a good recall because I have time to return before Yasuo. Ah, he recalled as well, it's fine. But he has bounty, that's funny. He's a level ahead and has bounty mostly because I went for the Drake and the kill on Shaco. And I'm a roamer, I have to take these risks. So, game is currently decent, but bot is still losing. The cannon teleport though managed to push us above again. Okay, got these minions. Have the GLP. I can go bot, but this might not be an optimal solution if Yasuo is still on mid. Okay. Ah, uh, this is a good bait because they think I will return to mid now. And they, when you see Tulia here, you don't really think that well, okay, he, she, no one is ganking bot and Rek'Sai is there, so I have the hopes of that. Okay, if now this was cast on bot, I have to start looking towards that and perhaps... Okay. Dodge the tornado, get away, he flashed, I flashed. It's fine. And we also won this. Okay, that's great. That's amazing. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I don't think he will dive. So that's why I'm recalling here. I'm not risking dying. I, he will get placed. It's inevitable. But I can't really keep fighting on him because. I had to stop him there, which is great, we stopped him and we won bot, because they managed to do fine, eventually our bot did better than theirs. And I can't really manage to keep the CS levels, because obviously it's a bad matchup for me. But I could have gone for something like Pantheon in auction, because I've seen the Asso pick, but then again, that would have been stupid, mostly because, mostly because of the fact that uh, Chogat would have stacked armor, now Tilus would have stacked armor and it's better to have 2 AP champs and 2 AD champs into that comp. Also I can get the plate here. And somehow Kennen got the kill onto Shaco and escaped now Tilus as well. So this is a free plate creation for me, because we know Shaco is not there. So I could go here. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine, because he didn't block it, but that was a bad, bad engage by me. Didn't have flash, but we still created some sort of advantage by killing that. Please don't die. Careful. Because if Yasuo goes there, that's a problem. This is a bad, this is a bad trade for us. Get out. Nah, this is bad. Because Yasuo will come as well. Okay. Cannon is nowhere to be found. Not sure why he went this way around. Confusing, but okay. He could have done more there, but he has a bounty, so it's fair. <sighs> that started bad on us because of the... Okay. Yeah, that's not cool. Okay, how can we keep on? Okay, got a shutdown onto the Asso. I am in in uh, Shaco's targeting right now. But I knew Shaco was there, so that's why I baited by that, but he shouldn't have got hit. 
by the Nautilus. Okay. Okay, that's what that's very worth. We got the kill onto that and we managed to survive this. Now Zonia is a excellent choice here. <laughs> Even though you have no damage, that much damage actually, you can and will supply the AP damage. I just have to survive the instant burst. This is bad. If he hits his ult, but he doesn't have it on Janna, she's dead. But for some reason he goes for Blade of the Rain King. I'm not. We have no tanks, I'm not getting that. I'm not understanding that. So, targets, targets. Get level 11, keep on the level with the Asu. Shogat is AFK, I think. Shogat disconnect. Man, that would make me sad because it changes a lot the dynamic of this game. Okay, get that. Thank you here. <laughs> okay, I think I think this is pretty much over. That was nice. And yeah, because Shogat is AFK, I think we won this game. I'm not sure why he called and went AFK, but we caught Yasuo again. And even though I'm 60 CS behind or so, 50. Okay. Can't go more than this. Guys, I used everything. And yep, this is an over game. We won it. And the only major fail that I did was that dive on bot. Because it wasn't that well done. And the other death, what was my other death? It's... Uh, I don't remember. I died two times. I'm not remembering the second death. Not a Yasuo kill, that's clear. So, Shaco assassination most likely. Yeah, so in, in hindsight, I'm almost the same level as Yasuo and 7 kill participation versus 3, it's practically the level lost. But this farm is what keeps him in the game and in most games, honestly, Let's say I would have played Twisted Fate and went bot three times and casted my ult and get got kills. Well, in that case Yasuo, I missed the cannon, Yasuo could have had so much more farm, look at that guy. And we would have still got the advantage. Look, all of his arm, what is he gonna do with all of that farm? If he's not getting a double kill here, then that's pointless. And he's turning it around, but not really. So again, pointless. The whole fact, the whole fact that he farmed, because he gets caught and because he dies, I am so wrong. Still, what I'm happy about is that I don't have frame drops anymore. But yeah, this should be a free game because of the AFK on Chogat. Standing here because of the shake on my jump on the Caitlyn. <laughs> what? He dodged. Don't ping me. Oh, come on, man. I would go further. I would go further, but... Shaco. Okay. Good ult by Cannon. What? Yeah, the Drake and the game, that was fine. Cannon played pretty good, even though she, he didn't teleport at that level 5, but it was not necessary to teleport there. Man, just, just get the base. Get the base. Still, sad that I could not showcase the entire game. Uh, I would not pick Lia if for not the Rek'Sai, I guess. Because the Rek'Sai is what kept me into the game by hitting those combos, by putting me up. 
As you can see, Kenan doesn't even have that much farm, just as me. He has roughly the same farm and the same kill participation as me, and the level ahead because of kills. Because of solo kills mostly. But he did outplay and he did carry this particularly. Uh, but the problem was on Yasuo mostly. I would vote that the problem was on Yasuo mostly because I could roam, Kenan could teleport, he did not move. And his only kills are because of the multiple roams from his team, but when you play Yasuo into a roamer, you gotta expect, man, you gotta expect to move a little. I had the Yasuo that hinted me like this. In terms of, he was against Nocturne, Nocturne did 6 ganks, game was over. And I'm not saying that he got, I was supporting that, I'm not saying he caught us like here in the middle of the day. No, he caught us into between towers. They did four main ganks, my jungler was not here, my mid laner would even bother, so I guess we just lost. Even though I moved around here to escape, he still caught us. As, as they dived, he was here. But because we have this kind of team, and this kind of response to roams, we are doing fine. And now with the Zonia, our chances of dying diminish heavily because of the survival that we could offer. Now we just can tank stuff, we're not afraid anymore, even with the Janna behind us. I wanna go here. Okay, still not gonna get hooked by the Nautilus, so if I get hooked I will flash out. I still have friend drops when the fights happen, when the team fights happen, and that's pretty big thing and look at this look at this friend drops man beautiful and he flashed I don't think he has any ways of escaping this yep I just chased him down I'm gonna get this for good measure Yeah, the fact that Caitlyn started playing so well after she initial deaths on bot, it's a great thing. Can I... Can I get this please? Thank you. And also we played pretty well with Rek'Sai, but we got caught by their four men engages. Oh man, tell me he dies. Wow! Oh, go to the close. Okay. Let's back off here. Okay. Can I stop him? And they surrendered. I'm sorry for the Cho'Gat, I'm not sure why he tilted and left. Maybe just a disconnect, but pretty much sure he's rage quitting. But yeah, that was the game, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the Talia mid in Diamond 1 against Diamond 1 or Masters, I'm not even sure. And see you next time with a new video. I'm trying to make more mid videos with ranked gameplay because I want to reach Master 100 points. I've said someone, I've said a friend on Discord that. I'm gonna main bar if I don't reach 100 points by September in Grandmaster, so that's going to be a challenge. I have a mod. <laughs> so let's go, guys. <laughs> See you next time. This was a Tilia tutorial, and have a nice day or night, guys. Wherever you are, I'm always thankful for you being here. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.